Alright guys, just this morning Motorcycle released a leak on the newest vehicle being added to the game and it's the V22 Osprey, I think you say it. Alright, so the first thing about the V22 Osprey that I want to say is it has both VTOL and STOL, which if you don't know means vertical takeoff and landing, like this, like the Harrier has. And it's also got STOL, which means short takeoff and landing. And that's basically just a normal takeoff like this. So that means that it will be a plane and it won't be a heli, in case anyone was wondering. Well, actually, I don't know too much about its guns, but I did some research and apparently I've read that it has a Gatling gun. I'm not sure if it'll include it in the game or not, it depends how much it can carry really. I forgot how good the Harrier was, Jesus. But yeah, I think it, it will have a Gatling gun, it'll be nothing else, it'll just be a Gatling gun, maybe a side gun or I don't know. But the main thing is, it's a transport heli, which means it can carry crates and oil barrels, which no plane has that yet, so that will be a nice interesting thing to have. But the V-22, I don't think it transports tanks or anything like that, so I don't think it'll be carrying anything. That'll be more like Chinook type stuff, I'm hoping we get that one day. So the next thing to talk about is the release date. So they've said that they're not announcing it yet, which means it definitely won't be next weekend. So it's most likely going to be like the one after. So it could either be on the 10th or the 17th. And I pray to God it's not the 10th, because I'm out on that day as well. Unless it's early morning, then I'll be able to do it, but if it's afternoon, I won't be able to. I'm hoping it's the 17th, because I've got nothing planned for that day yet. Oh yeah, another thing I do want to mention, it's not really a big leak, but it's a small leak. So basically, Kizmo have said that they might change the barrel roll to Q and E instead of A and D. Because I will say myself, and I'm sure you lot can agree with me, that pressing A and D for barrel roll is a bit confusing. You know, you'd prefer that to turn your plane around, you don't really want to use your mouse. I bet it's impossible for mobile players. So I think we can all agree that having Q and E would be better than A and D. Even though the only problem with that would be that it might interfere with hover. But I don't think you can barrel roll when you're hovering anyway. Oh yeah, and that reminds me, the Eurofighter, which you saw in the leak, you know, it was a while ago, when we were getting the F-16 update. Uh, yeah, but that kind of just got forgotten about, didn't it? No one really talks about that anymore. Uh, but I feel like it might get added in this update, you know, because it's a plane update, we're getting one new plane, and they've not set a release date, so that might mean that it's coming with the Eurofighter. I suppose we don't know yet, but I feel like it might do. And if it is, that means it might be released on the 17th, that's my guess, 17th. But like I said, it could be the 10th. We'll never know. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Make sure to subscribe. And the next one I'm going to do is I'm going to do an updated version of the MI-28 versus MI-24 thing, because I know it's a bit inaccurate on some of the details there. But for now, just click on one of the videos on screen and go and watch that.